Well, you know now, that least six are the big, real threat, not Eggman, so, guess that's uh, an interesting change of pace going forward here. Hey guys, it's come here and we are back for more Sonic Lost World. Last time we did Desert Ruins, and this time we'll be going on to the next world, which is Tropical Coast, and one thing I forgot to, uh, I haven't shown on the world map yet is, if you press any direct upward, left or right, or up or down on the control pad here, or the Wii U game pad, you can just immediately re like, move to that level you're going for, for here, and instead of just having to walk from hexagon to hexagon. <laughs> so, that's something I didn't even get the chance to show, but, but now, but now I did. And yeah, now we're just getting to our next zone here, which is just tropical coast. Like, I know the the zone. Yeah, you know, like I know what that the state acts are called zones for these, but yeah, and it was kind of the themes we're going to is kind of called worlds or something. But yeah, I'm just calling these by acts because that just feels a little bit more right. <laughs> Yeah, but no, look at that, another gold pipe in. Okay, right, let's get that little bell there so we can okay, get that in. I think if we take too long, the bell will just, will just disappear and I think, oh no, I know this. So, go. <laughs> Freaking water guys, who is that? Come on, this freaking guy who just. Yeah. And there we go, we got ourselves some red rain. Took a little bit of effort to do, but we got it. And gonna backtrack to that gold pipe cannon and that egg ponds here. And I think with these guys, you can't just, uh, just homie attack them, you have to homie kick them. Um, and then. Oh, um, too. And, Instantly kill them. Um, but, but yeah, the only thing about the only attack you, as you can see here is that you can lock onto multiple enemies at a time. And it's much more easier to do that in the 3DS version, but I'll get to, get to the 3DS version because, yeah, at one, some point, because you have some stuff to say about it, but yeah. But I'll just make this brief now. Oh, wait. The Wii U version is better than one of the two. Ooh, but, yeah, well, I'll get to that later. Ooh, once we actually do the 3DS version, but, but now, well, we're just doing the Wii U version, which, which by, by far is the better one out of the, the two. And on uh, this part here, we have to go find five butterflies and bring them to the center here. And, Let's go on to the next part. Alright, so... Yeah, then... And... There aren't many points here where I'm using the drill whisk because... Yeah, I just haven't ran into any points here. Or actually, we might have come up to one now. Okay, well, we can use the drill whisk when we're inside the water there. Just like, you know, colors. Or, you know, you can... When you're in Aquarium Park. Right. Right. Yeah, you don't get a, a different theme depending on if you're digging in dirt or water. Right. Yeah, not, that's a little bit of a step back, but that's okay. Right, so, yeah, one. And on we go to Bouncing Clouds here and. You know, me sniffling a lot, quite a bit throughout this, you know that. You can't do that, allergies, because uh, our allergy season's kind of started for me, so. Yeah, but, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, it technically it's already started by the time this video has gone up. And, you get so many one ups here. Oh no, I missed. <laughs> Is but no problem. Um, I can just easily 
do this again. Yeah. Plus, we have plenty of lives, so it's not like we needed to do that in. And yeah, I did write down for some of the circus tents off camera. But at least the ones that we had unlocked currently, I didn't go back and play any levels for Red Ring. And so, yeah. Uh, because, yeah, we need Red Ring to unlock the circus tents. I probably don't need to gra grab all. I don't need to grab every single life here. You know, just, just grabbing a few because I can. And at the end of the stage here. Yep, there we go. I think we have cutscene now. Alas, poor Cuba. I knew him well. Arr, me voice chips all catty wampus. Thanks to Sonic, everything's gone catty wampus. My concoctment cock was the only thing keeping those six maniacs in check. Some sort of a natural inhibitor to their powers. They're painful. And very rare. The Zeki have an innate ability to manipulate magnetic fields. They can make electronics, including my mechs, do interesting things. I control those powers with the punk. Until Sonic punted it away with his typical stupidity. Well, get lost, Eggman, and let us get things under control. I hope the Zeki eat you alive. You meddling hedgehog. Okay, if it pleases the court, all those who think Eggman is a total bonehead raise their hands. Well, there you go, folks. The motion is passed unanimously. Yeah, so that's what I was a cat, which is or whatever how you pronounce it, con. But oh well, I'm not gonna probably pronounce it again. But yeah, here we go. But pretty much just here we out and that's me too. too. But here we out, we just have kind of like. Thing too is that you may have noticed like the previous cutscenes for the that they introduced the uh, deadly six kind of one by one, except for like that block they showed him like from the start when you don't fight him until much later in the game. You know, but yeah, because like you may have noticed like in Windy Hill, like only two of the deadly six were shown because kind of waiting to reveal them all one by one on here, like one is that equal world. <laughs> Here, but yeah, yeah, because yeah, uh, that a little a small light blue one was Nate is Master Zick. So yeah, I think he's the oldest one out of all of them. And then yeah, and then other thing too about these little water things is that if you just press hold the run button, you go through them a lot faster. So it's a good way to for speed running this to you. So back in health and yeah, what I was talking about to say before all the like before that cutscene thing was that from here on out, you know, Q bot will just be ahead. But he won't have that, that pirate voice forever. Although it is kind of a nice little callback to their colors when he had the pirate voice. <laughs> but but it's also nice that we got he got an actual voice this time around that get can he can actually stick with, with. Yeah, so that's nice. Better than him just constantly having his voice chip be changed. Yeah. But uh, yeah. Well. Mm -hmm. 
And luckily this is also the last time Cubot will have his voice chip be changed. But, yeah, unless they decide to bring it back. <laughs> Technically they did, because, you know, color is ultimate, but eh, that's just the remaster of the color, so... Uh, so, it depends on what, if you want to count that or not. Uh, but, anyway, yeah. Big, big gimmick throughout this level here you was know, you have a whole bunch of, of giant you know, fruit that you have to get just like some blenders here. Um, or was, I guess some blades, and be sure you don't touch the blades, otherwise, it's instant kill. Oh, and, oh, and I think touching the the fruit, fruit here will also hurt, hurt if you, t but yeah, if you just run into the spinning blades here, you, you know, it's instant kill. So, so we can do that, and, oh, you don't do that, no, oh, come on, I could, if only you gave me a jump there. Yeah. Oh, why don't you just give me the lock on? Oh, oh, wait. Okay, fine. Seven, you away. He came with those freaking chickens that. Yeah. But anyway, what's. But yeah, I did pick up the rocket wisp early, you know, but I didn't get a chance to use it yet. But. Yeah, we'll be able to use it soon. If not on this level, we will in a later level. And. They actually can change. This is actually, I think, the only wisp that they've actually improved upon it. Because. Yeah, because, like, in the. In back in colors, you could only. And generations. You, know, you could only activate the rocket wisp whenever you were in, you were in 2D. Yeah, but here you can access it in 3D. Again, not only that, they even changed up how you how you use it as well uh, so actually I think we get it after we destroy all the motor bugs on this planet it's so uh, yeah and okay oh come on yep <laughs> got the rocket wisp you and yeah what do you do is you have to Aim where you want to go and and fire away. Sure, handle it's definitely a lot better than how to handle it in colors. There's even and uh, yeah, I, even though it kind of does the same thing, just you can you just fl go pretty high up and and that's it. And then. <laughs> Oh. oh yeah, I remember what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to get him, lower him into this. Come here, Zick. Okay, there you go. Man, it just, this just sends you on like a loop around to the other side here. And this will also give you a chance to attack him. Getting back in there, come on! Damn it! Uh, and I think he's supposed to get also a new route as well, but I guess I beat him fast enough to where that didn't happen. Yeah, oh, yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like we were playing the PC version, that little step. Tails is my electric in the corner of the load screen. We would actually get a little computer screen. And so that's one little difference. I tested the blue one, and he's more powerful than I anticipated. He shows much potential. You don't tell us about him. Now that I'm free, I will increase that man to his power. And eat him. I suppose. Uh, well, yeah. There are better ways to make him suffer. Uh, but more delicious? What would you say if I told you we could destroy Eggman's world and use its energy to make 
ourselves unbelievably powerful. Well, I would say that I have taught you well. own creation causes his destruction. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm afraid they were using Eggman's machine to observe the pain as she went. This entire stage she was a veil bending stage and world beating running tip just constantly jump because well, then you'll go faster. Yeah. I don't know if it, holding the run button helps or not here, but I'll hold. I'll still hold it just in case here. Yeah, but yeah, you also have these red rails where if you get on them, you slow down. And green ones that you step on them, you go faster. And you also have these gates here you have to open, and if you don't open them, you slam right into them, and it counts as a death. Yeah. Yeah, so we have writing stage, so it's kind of cool. I mean, being yeah, it is quite quite nice, especially since you don't have any regular rail grinding in the actual stages. Well, maybe you do, but I don't remember. But I know for the Wii U version, you do. I mean, the 3DS version. Not sure about the Wii U version. <laughs> but yeah, there's only two stages in the entire game that are dedicated to just rail grinding. I think which you know the. Oh, cool and all, but like I said, you actually have to jump from rail to rail, not, a, not just, you know, pressing a button and you automatically jump to it, which I don't mind that thing, it just feels like you have a little bit more, more, it feels like you have a little bit more of a challenge when you actually jump, have to actually jump from the rail, rail but yeah, that's just me. You get like I don't hate how the, the way of grinding is handled though nowadays with the you just press a button and you meet or like one one of the bumpers or whatever direction on the control stick and you just do it. It just feels like it's a little bit e too e e si simple as way possible. Well, well how it was handled in Adventure Two and Heroes, you just was you just hold the direction you want to go and left or right and then you press A and you just go for it. It's not perfect, because sometimes you might actually fly off the rails, but I prefer it over how the, the rail grinding is handled in nowadays. Yeah, that's just my opinion. Of course you can still have fun sections in the rail grinding with the how it's handled nowadays as well. Well, but yeah, that's just, well, that's just me here. Here, but... Yeah, anyway, let's just keep the beat run, do jumping here, hit. And, and we got all red rings for first time we got that, I think, unless we got one in a previous stage in Tropical Coast. <laughs> and I don't think we did. But I'll take a look after this. Yeah, that's what's happening because the world just gets drained, losing all its energy. And yeah, we needed a thousand flickies for that one, but we have twice as many. And so we'll in the clear for that. See, okay, no, we didn't get all red rings in here. Yeah, so that's the first one. Time for that. And if we get all five here, we unlock this circus tent. <laughs> Yeah, 
time is almost over, rash hedgehog. I shall prepare for you a lesson in respect. A painful lesson. Oh, someone's gonna get taken to school, all right. Follow, if you dare. Oh, I upset that day, uh, Master Zack. <laughs> Yeah, okay, that, that's what we do. And kind of have like an alternate, several alternate pathways we can go on here. We could either go to that one, plan it, or we could go to that one, or we could go to that one. one but, yeah. I'm not sure if there's a limit to how far you can go with a, aim with a rocket with you. It probably is. Is it? Oh, right, these freaking chicken moths. But you have to roll this pineapple into them. Um, and the, and they get squid, they get, get killed. And, uh, yeah, but yeah, how the pineapple works, so you, you just have to kind of push it even though you're not actually touching it. No. No, uh, because it sucks that you can't just come up to these guys normally, you have to actually He's like, he can't even attack them normally. Hey, but at least the 3DS version fixes that, but... Oh, well. Oh, I'll just... I still don't want to say too much about the 3DS version yet, because I want to save it for when I actually do that version. Yeah. Okay, there we go. That took a little longer than, far than it should have. <laughs> Get the balloons, but alright, And on a wing planet, yeah. Okay, we need to get all the wings. And I believe if you just flop, boost off into nothingness like this, you'll just die. And yeah, this is where we need to go. And. Let me just get the checkpoint just because we may need it. Do do Let's get that get all the better in here and Yeah. Another thing about the circus tents is well for, darn it. Is that the red wings say uh, add up for that oil audio in. And so it's not like you can just get uh, get red wings and like a later world, and it will add up for the ones in that pre previous world. Oh, uh, that, that makes any sense? Wait, it does. Uh, what am I saying about that? Huh? <laughs> and and oh, that convenient all butterflies are at the end here. All right. And now we're in a two D section. Oh, yeah, well, to be fair, most of, so far, all of, well, actually, there was kind of a, some 2D sections in the rail grinding stage we did before this, so, oh, uh, yeah, and that's something, and, oh, well, I will say, the, the amount of 2D sections they have handled here is pretty, pretty well here, for the most part, unlike, you know, Colors and Generations, well. About a good chunk of those games were were 2D, yeah, especially Generations, cause cause if that got game had way too much 2D in it and not enough 3D, but it is what it is. Oh right, yeah, you're supposed to hold me to attack that, and we do get up to the top of here to get the red wing. like a wave that would launch you up into those spike balls, but I guess not, and, oh. No. <laughs> One more red wing, and we have all of them here. 
Okay, but maybe this is what I was thinking of. Could you? Oh, yeah, that, yeah, this is what it said. Yeah, I think that fish will is an instant kill if you get eat, eaten by it. Yeah. So let's. I don't know if you I want all the spikes here. Oh. Oh, you know. Okay, that, this is actually what I was thinking of here. There we go. We got all red wings. Two stages in a row. Oh, but keep getting hit. So. But anyway, well, yeah. I think that's also an insta kill if you just get launched a few. Oh, but I'm not sure because. I have not gotten killed by them at all. But now I think we're coming up to the boss. Yeah, we are. And, oh, he has like this little fruit shield, but. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And now he's gone to a different planet, so. Oh, yeah, we're. Don't know where to go, we're taking for the balloon! Okay, I mean, it has a cannon, so I guess all balloon, most balloons will have cannons in them, hidden in them, or something, but I'm not, not sure. So, yeah, here he is. I'm trying to, I couldn't get away! Uh, and unfortunately, we're back here. And, and oh, come on! Mm. And yeah, I mean, one thing I haven't mentioned yet is that you actually are on a time limit. I mean, like each stage it has a time limit, and it's kind of like the classic games, but... Oh wow, I thought I was dead now! <laughs> like, I saw myself go in the water, I was like, okay, that's it. Yeah. But, no, yeah, I just somehow climbed the wall out of it. <laughs> I'll have to watch that back and see. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's what I was trying to do before. Yeah, okay. To the balloon we go. I do like how the balloons from Adventure 2 where, uh, where that can give you rings or possibly a one up or, or a shield. Hey, okay, I'll wait for him to stop spinning and then go for it. Yeah, yeah that, this is what you're supposed to do. Do, 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 do. A whole bunch of berries to use for uh, that make it a berry shield <laughs> or a berry. Oh, <laughs> this I didn't even think about that until now. <laughs> I think if you destroy too many of these, he will he will form a new one. One, one but no. Oh, well, I, if I only one way to find out is oh, I got him there. Uh, Boom! Then got away again. Fire! <clears throat> Boom! To there. No, this time you're not getting a shield th that time. Mm. Yeah. Yes. We have a mutual rock. One so much that it will take both of us to overcome whatever. I told you, we can handle the Zeddy by ourselves. But that may be true, but the rebellious swine have gotten hold of a device of mine, and they're using it in ways for which it was never designed. Uh, what was it designed for, Doctor? <coughs> supposed to extract energy from our world, but the machine is unstable. Once it reaches full power, it can't be shut off. It will drain our world dry. Oh, so that's what Amy was talking about. And you just want to go smash it, don't you? Well, yeah. Uh. What? It's what I do. Oh, always your answer to everything, Hedgehog. If you wish to create a cataclysmic explosion that will incinerate everything within a hundred miles, 
please smash away. So there's no off switch? No, not anymore. I need to get to the machine and reprogram the shutdown sequence. I'll supply the brains. You will supply the brawn I need to get past the Zeti. Oh, and you're asking so nice. <laughs> Good one, buddy. <laughs> Thanks. Man up, Tails. I don't like working with my most hated enemies any more than you do. But our entire world is at stake. Yeah, well, teaming up with you feels like the end of the world, eh, man? I'm gonna want to take a long shower by the time we're done. <laughs> Seems like anyone who, who be, be smashing some of its knuckles first. Then, oh, what is that? You, uh, we've not seen that before. Because, you know, knuckles is the kind of person who just wants to smash stuff first and then ask questions later. <clears throat> but yeah, we have an extra, extra act to play here. <clears throat> because, like, there's a couple extra stages to get in the game. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna do them here, since, might as well, and, yeah. Yeah, I think there's a concept like this that we're doing, we'll, that'll come much later, so I don't want to bring it up now. Uh, so, yeah, <laughs> and then, can, it's also a good, kind of a good stage here to grind out the lives. It's good. You can get a bunch of rings here, and... And some one ups. Then, yeah, just throw it away here and then head on to that, to the, that damn boy world. <laughs> we can, okay, even though we don't get that damn fuck chaos in it. <laughs> things here but yeah. yeah yeah no matter how much longer the stage is I think we're coming up close to the end oh uh, it's a big one we got here oh whew. okay made it through that Yeah, that'll get at the end. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't really get too many one-ups from that, but it doesn't really matter. 